I think it's his main. That's the character I see him play the most. Excuse me. Once again, I'm a little bit under the weather, so I apologize if I sound raspy. And if my body's rebelling against me. But no one else wanted to commentate, so I'm going to do it. Oh, we're getting the Mac, the bruiser from the Bronx. That's the New York character. He's so bad, but yet he's from New York, so we have to like him, is what I've been saying. I could be entirely wrong. Bro, he's a chronological New Yorker. He's allowed to say you're unironically. Like, you gotta be kidding me. Like, what other states have a character representative? They have, like, Ken for California. Terry's state is unknown. It's probably Jersey. Because what other state would have a crime lord named Geese take over other than New Jersey? Who else? Ryu's from somewhere in Japan. I don't think they've ever said. The Joker's from Tokyo. Other than that, though. All right, so let's see how this Mac does against JVD's Diddy. Diddy has to play a bit patiently. Mac, Mac wants to move around, try to open up his opponent. Ooh, gets the KO punch online, but he's not been able to get in too much on this game. JVD with the banana. Able to help control a lot of space, take a lot of ground game away from Mac, which is where he wants to stay. Ooh, down tilt into the side B. Very nice, putting on that damage. C plus trying to grab the recovery there from JVD, but he's able to snap to the ledge. All right, trying to poke with him at the ledge. And just letting him off the ledge for free, Mac. I don't think he can really contest the jump ins, and so he's able to. So he's rather just regain the, the center stage and gets up smash there. C plus not looking too happy at that. But. He's not in too bad of a position. Lil Mac has a lot of potential to kill. Ooh, gets tripped by the banana though, and here comes some damage. Ooh, gets through, throws it out. JVD goes down, and now we got ourselves an even game. Ooh, he stepped over the banana with forward smash. That's crazy. I didn't know you could do that. All right, the rapid jab starting to lay on this damage. Ooh, dash attack. Not able to get a follow up out of it. Ooh, anti airs him. Just throwing out these up tilts. Ooh, the parry. Throws the banana back at him. Able to go over the banana with the monkey flip. C plus doing a good job though. He's holding the projectile. Ooh, drops the banana. Uh, doesn't fall in place till they get the down smash. But uh, that was very smart though by C plus. Just taking control of the banana. Removing that tool from Diddy's kit, which is very limiting to him. And he's able to catch his recovery. And he, the barrel's coming back at him, and he parried the barrel. My man's is on a mission. Ooh, blocks the dash attack, gets the grab, starting to get the damage. Doesn't get a follow-up off the grab. Ooh, gets caught on the forward smash, but he's living. Yes, he is. Able to save that jump. Ooh, spot dodges through that forward tilt. Gets the poke there. All right, now JVD has the time to set up. My man's went under. He did the thing. He did the he did the thing all Little Max do, which is you wall jump on the bottom of PS2 and you just get to live. But it, that was good on him. He was able to mix up the timing on his recovery, and JVD didn't seem ready for it. He went to like more central stage trying to figure out what he was doing. I'm not sure if JVD was familiar with that type of recovery. But he's able to take that stock JVD, and now he's starting to lay on this damage. Gets the monkey flip grab. All right. Ooh, read the roll. Gets the grab. Yeah, this is not where you want to be if you're C+. Plus. You don't want to be on the ledge. Especially as Mac. No matter what matchup it is, you do not want to be on that ledge. You want to be in between your the stage, the central stage, and your opponent at all times as Mac. But C-Plus doing a really good job, though, at, like, mixing up his recovery when he does go off stage, And also doing a really good job at being able to control the ground game, which is where he's been able to get a lot of his damage. Also anti-airing JVD quite a lot with that up tilt. Tries to get the down smash poke. Doesn't get it. JVD goes straight to the ledge. All right, the forward throw. JVD just trying to keep him off stage, And that fair, yeah, that's going to do it. Good job from JVD there. Being able to bring that back. He was down quite a little bit on that, on that last stock, but... Not, not too bad. But also, C plus really schmoving with that Mac. Being able to control a lot of that ground game is very impressive. We'll see how things change here in game two. Once again, C plus does have a Lucas. 
So it might come out here if he's not feeling that the Mac is up to it. However, the Mac did really well. We're going to run it back to PS2. And he's going back to the Mac. All right, this is what I like to see. I like to see the music from the Bronx. All right, and here we go. Ooh, able to catch that landing immediately with the rapid jab, starting the game off strong. Once again, takes the banana, moving that tool. But Diddy Kong's able to pull that back out again. And JVD starting to lay on this damage. All right, the up throw, the up air. Ooh, just throwing it at him. However, he does get punished for it. The banana, the dash attack, throws it up. C plus able to get back to the ground, starting to lay on this damage. Nah, he's gonna he's gonna whiff that second up tilt. He's gonna. Throw out a rapid jab. Try to recover the situation. However, he does get punished. Ooh, tries to throw it out on the trip on the banana, but JVD able to roll in time, just able to avoid it. All right, the banana back in play. Ooh, that's not... All right, he's alive. Yep, it holds his jump. That's one thing you have to do as a Mac player. You have to be able to know how to how to do your, your mix as a, as a recovery. Because you don't have too much mix, but it is possible. All right, C plus just moving around the ground, just trying to threaten that space there. Max very quick on the ground. And he's able to just run around and just immediately stop his dash and up tilt. Just keep JVD on that platform, but he's gonna get hit by that banana and up smash. He's not too far out of it. This is about how the, how the first game went. All right, now you see JVD camping that platform there a lot. He's able to control that space. So that's very smart on him. He's able to, he knows Max don't want to go up there. However, Max can deal with that situation if you stay up there. So you notice how he's not just standing on the platform, but he's moving around on that platform, trying to bait out an option from C+, something that he doesn't want to throw out, but has to throw out in his mind, in C+, his mind. C plus, he's trying to make C+, think this is my only option when it's not. All right, he's able to get back. C plus just needs to. Oh, he throws out the KO punch and is able to catch him on the platform there. Yeah, K KO punch. Very strong. Obviously, it's a KO punch. But also, he rises up and it can catch jumps too. So, very, very good on him. Able to catch it. He needed to just throw that out. He just needed to get rid of that stock. And as you can see here, he's already starting to lay on this damage again. Ooh, almost got the grab there. Ooh, the banana, the forward smash. Still not quite enough. All right, he's going to get back here off of the upbeat. All right, gets back aired, not where you want to be, but he's able to get back to the ledge. Gets caught by the banana and then fared. Ooh, that was nasty. All right, gets caught by the banana. It, getting some damage off of this throw. Nice monkey flip, able to put on more damage. Gets the dash attack. JVD starting to run away with this damage, but ooh, C plus able to get that down tilt into side B. He needs to do a little bit more than that, though, in order to secure this stock. Ooh, the dash attack. All right, and JVD's back, but no, it gets caught on the getup. All right, and we got ourselves a pretty interesting game here, folks. This is not out of the realm of possibility for Mac. And gets, what was that, three up tilts? That's crazy. All right, monkey flip in, able to get that damage. Ooh, back aired. He does have KO Punch online. This is a bit scary. Oh, no, he lost it. Never mind. I lied. But still, it's Mac. You can't underestimate him. He has good damage output. All right, gets the down tilt. Ooh, he went for it. Gets caught by the banana. All right. Ooh, able to get back. That forward tilt, laying on that damage. Goes the banana up. Doesn't catch him with the down smash. Monkey flip. And that's going to do it. Good job there from JVD, realizing that he was just going to hold shield. So instead of throwing out the uh, aerial, I'm just going to do the grab.